I wanna welcome you to the Ask Jeff YouTube channel. Here's today's question. If, and that's important, if God and Satan put their differences aside and are on good terms with one another, would we see any difference on earth or would we have to wait to go to heaven? Well, let me answer this question in reverse. Oh yeah, we'd see a huge difference because you no longer have one orchestrating vile temptation. You would no longer have the quote, God of this world, a breathing death and destruction, the one whom Jesus called a liar from the beginning. Everything would change. Here's the problem. For things to quote unquote change, it's the first part of the question we have issues with for them to, quote, put their differences aside. Here's the issue. We have biblical evidence that Satan is never going to put his issues aside. In fact, after a thousand years of being bound in the bottomless pit in Revelation chapter 20, the first thing he does when he comes up is he rebels against God again. For God to put away his differences, he would have to somehow condone and dismiss sin. And so basically you have an inherently sinful creature who's not willing to repent and you have a holy God who's not willing to compromise on sin. So they cannot put their respective differences aside. So how do we get, quote, peace on earth? The only way for this question to be answered the way it is desired is that Satan himself, and the Bible gives no evidence that he'll do this, would have to repent of his sin and he would have to confess his allegiance to God alone. On this issue, God will not and cannot budge. Great question. If you have one, send it to askjeff.net. Maybe your question will be tomorrow. Thanks for being a part of today's daily question. Now, we answer a question each and every day. Please feel free to submit a new question at askjeff.net. Net. We may not have gotten to yours today, but we eventually will continue to be a part of this. Subscribe so you don't miss out on a question every day.